Hi friends, I'm Nancy Jacobs, the Basket Master, here with another little Christmas basket to show you, or a little Christmas woven ornament, little angel. And I need to start out by saying, I didn't weave this one. This was woven and given to me by a dear basket weaving friend, uh, Juliana Dean. And Julie, she blogs over at A Hand Woven Life. And there, you could, there's some. She's got some free basket patterns for you on her site. So be sure to pop over there and get some more creative ideas from her. Anyway, let's take a look at how she wove this little angel. Isn't that lovely? Isn't she sweet? She's made to be an ornament, or she could go on top of a small Christmas tree. Or I have her sitting on my kitchen windowsill. So take a look here. Look at the shape of this, of her dress there. Doesn't that look kind of like a bell? Well, it started out by weaving at the top. And if you look closely on the inside, there is a little wooden disc. And that little wooden disc has holes in it similar to the little mini sleigh that I've been referring to here. You remember the little mini sleigh and how it's got the holes in the base and the round reed comes through the holes? Well, take a look here. The little disc in there has holes in it in which the number two round reed has been inserted into. And so she started weaving there at the top of the little angel's dress and the number two round reed is the spokes and she has then woven around with 11 64ths inch flat oval and she's finished off the dress with by taking those spokes and turning them into a braided rim and then to finish off the angel she's glued a, a little bead here that she's got painted uh, with the eyes and the cheeks and then she's put a couple ribbons on here a large ribbon for the angel's wings and a little small one for the uh, just a bow on the on the dress she's taken Spanish moss and has made the hair and then for the halo is a number two round reed which she has twisted into a little circle. Put a hanger on there. Is that cute? Is that sweet or what? Just look, friends, what we can do with our weaving. It doesn't have to be a basket. It can turn into something just as sweet as this little ornament. Just by weaving. Normally we weave from the bottom up. Here we've woven from the top down. Very, very cute. All right, enjoy. I hope you ha are having just a beautiful and blessed and wonderful Christmas. God bless. Thanks for watching. You guys can see more tips and techniques on my blog at www.basketmasterweavings.blogspot.com. All right, thanks everyone. Take care. Bye-bye.